And we're back with some more. Let's learn Hearthstone. So the last time we unfortunately had our first loss, but he also won, I think, two of our two games. Yeah, one versus a mage and one versus a warlock. I lost versus a paladin because of the stupid blood knight. So yeah, let's continue some more. Hopefully we get to seven wins. I am only two wins away, which would be great. Let's see. Maybe we can go higher. Who knows? I might hit my ten, tenth, mar tenth win, which would be a first for me. So yeah. Or we could lose two games in a row, which would suck. Really bad. But, okay. So versus another Paladin. Paladin? Paladin? Which we had lost before. So, okay, so... Okay. I'll, I'll keep the Abusive, I'll keep the Fairy, I'll remove these two. Oh, good, we have a Kazan. Kazan is really good versus Paladin. Because if, if you steal a, a, a secret, that would be fantastic. So now I think I'm going to coin out the Stone Splinter. Because since I have two drops, I two, uh, two two drops. I'd want to coin the first one out. I think that's my that's probably my biggest weakness is not knowing when to use the coin. But I think coining out a two drop when you have two is fine. I mean, if you have if I had example one two three and then a five drop, then I'd know when to coin. But I think now would be a good idea to coin, especially if he plays a minion. Then I could put this down, put something that challenges it. If you put Zombie Chow, I can Fairy Dragon, that challenges it. We'll see. Which is, would it be a fantastic trade, because that it'd be a one cost for a, a Fairy Dragon and a coin. We'll, we'll, we'll have to see. So this guy clearly takes long, because he took forever to mulligan and he took forever to choose. Oh god, all of our three drops again. So I think we're gonna coin out Stone Splitter. Also, the Wild Pyro does proc with a coin, but that's, I don't know. I only have two spells then. It's not the best idea. Okay, that's good. Shielded minibot. I don't I don't wanna give him two minions, so I'm just gonna hit him in the face. I could have hit it and hit it and he would have hit it. Which would have been a better idea. Yeah, that was a misplay. I should have hit him, hit hit it. Shields up, red alert. Okay. <clears throat> and this sucks. J just putting it out there and just, you know, if you think I'm thinking of a fantastic play or something. No, this just really, really sucks. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. A second there. Secrets are also spells. So, bam. 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 Oh yes, that was great. Uh, that was felt fantastic. I am stupid. I, why, what did I, why didn't I think this was a, a spell? A secret wasn't a spell. Jesus, I'm so dumb. Reporting for duty. Oh, that sucks. So, do I want to trade in everything? Hmm, that is the question. Or do I want to go face and let him trade into me? Since I do have a venge. Hmm. Or I could just re retake control of the board. I want to kill the direwolf. The direwolf has to die. I don't have any more spells to proc this and do some fancy stuff. And there's no way this can live unless I drew the 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 thing. Stupid, what's it called? Like Foods Doctor. But since he has to trade here, I'm going to hit him. This might have been a mistake since he, has, he could have consecrate, but if he had consecrate, he would had he would have used it last turn. So since he has to trade, he ha since he this is a three one to one one, he has to trade. If he doesn't trade, I just put my one one to his one one. He can buff it, but this this will trade easily into that. So yeah, that's great. I I I got three more damage on his face, and now I have also avenge, which hopefully oh that hits that. I would better if it hits it. If it hits this, jeez. So now I can uh, abuse the sergeant that and kill it, which is great. Oh, Anixia, how are you doing? Do so we'll do that, kill it, and then hit him in the face, and here we are. Pretty easy trade, pretty easy turn. Now he probably trades 1-1 one, one to my 2-1. If he plays something big, I'll, t I'll Aldor Peacecape it. If he... The, his points are the secret, I'll take control of it. So yeah, we have pretty good answers. Except, oh yeah, yeah, big dude. 
Altar Peacekeeper. So, Altar Peacekeeper. And hit him in the face. I'm gonna turn pass. I don't want to get him C-Tacked. That would be awful. That's probably the only way I could lose if I got him C-Tacked. So, let's see his response to this. I do have lethal on the board. He has to kill something. Unless he heals. He does have Guardian of King turn. Yeah, next year is a dragon. Yeah. Mm. So, Dragon Consort does work out to this and with my Fairy Dragon. So, my Fairy Dragon can cause zero man. Oh, God. Yes, Iron Jesus. Thank you, Iron Jesus. Reporting for duty. And it should, do I alder Peacekeeper this stupid thing and then hit him in the face? Oh, I want to. I'm going to do that. that and all of these don't even trade into this. Oh my god, that is so good. Alder Peacekeepers are the best. And now he has to kill a lot of shit to, to win. I basically win now. I mean, if he has something that would have... That can win. How can he come back from this? Maybe Blessing of Kings and kill it? And he has to kill rid of these, which he can with this, so then he'll be at 1 HP, he has to heal. Then, I, I wish Alexia cost 8. Hmm, let's see. Blessing of Kings. Cool, okay. That's fine. He starts to put, he has to sack something. He starts to kill these two. Unless it's a taunt or a heal. I still win. And if he secrets out a noble sack, that would be so cool because I can take it. But, oh, yeah, we win. So we're six and zero. Oh, we're six and one. So we just need one more win to get into gold back territory. I think I'm playing pretty well for being a noob. Like I do misplay a little. Like when I put, like when I was first as that mage and I put the Argent Squire. I mean, absolutely Sergeant onto the wolf when I was gonna hit it with my face. I was so dumb. Uh, yeah, little things I need to think more of, like the turns especially, like, hey, it's a flame strike turn, god, under paladin. I will fight with honor. So, these all kind of suck. I think I'm going to keep the Voodoo Doctor since I'm going first. I think I'm just going to keep the Voodoo Doctor and play turn one. Yeah, I'm yeah, thank god I kept the Voodoo Doctor. Jesus, I would have nothing to play for ever. So, I'm just going to play turn one. It does suck, but yeah, whatever. It is what it is. If he the hero powers and he can trade with it, but you know, it sucks. I have nothing to play. My hand is so ugh. I don't know what he's gonna coin, probably shield mini. Oh what coin Whoa! Coin minion. That's not necessarily what something would have done. That was weird. What the hell did the food doctor say? Like <sighs> So what now he's gonna Okay. That sucks. That's annoying. The question is, do I want to Aldor Peacekeeper that? That was so bad. No, no. I'm just gonna hear power into him. And then next turn, I'll just do this. Or if he, if he, if he kings this or something. Noxramus. Yeah, yeah. Definitely gonna hit it. Look at it. Yeah. And then Yeti. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Okay. Pretty simple. Nox that that this shade can get annoying, especially if he buffs it. But if he hits with it, I'm gonna silence it. And that'd be two two again, so. Mind if I roll need? Yes, I mind if I ro you roll weed. Reporting for duty. Mm, reporting for daughter. What? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so I do I hero power and and hit hit? And then hit him face, or do I? I mean, hit it, then nothing, or do I? True silver champion and hit that. Uh, both are kind of meh. I, I could silence that, but I think a silence is, is more useful. Hmm. I think I'll just true silver and hit him in the face. And then I'll save it. I don't think there's there's any reason to hit to trade here. I mean, what this, this he has three damage. Yeah, see, I can hit it now, so that's fine. Then I can hog her next turn. So now, now, now is when I hit the stupid loot hunter, because then I hit it. 
Because now the hogger will give a 1-1, one, one, a 2-2, two, two, which, which it, this can't kill. Great. So we've got great port control, and if he hits with that, I can silence it, which will be great. Screw you, Shade of Noxoramus. Consecrate doesn't do much for him. It does this a 4-2, this is a 4-1 that hits, and these with this, but eh. Let's see what he plays. Oh, equality, okay. That's good for him. Oh, equality, consecrate. Oh, shh, that hurts. Okay, so I could... So I think I'm gonna Aldor Peacekeeper that and hit it with my face. And then I'm gonna Imposter. Right? Or do I want to Gnomish? No, Imposter. He was out of removal for that, so I'm assuming he doesn't have much more. Next turn I can force tank, for sure. I like Imp Master versus the Paladin since it deals so nicely with his stupid hero power. Okay, that's fine, since I have force tank next turn. I'll probably go face, yeah. Oh yeah, for so force tank. Oh, if he kings it, I die. But I'm gonna assume he doesn't have it here. Then next turn I can hit it with this, and then Onyxia. I can also Nukum Mobilize Onyxia. Oh god. Oh no. Oh Jesus. That was probably really good for him. Since I can't straight trade now. Oh, Blessing of Wisdom. Oh, I can silence that! Oh my god, that is so cool. It's clobbering time for silence. So, poop, poop. And then, oh, okay, okay. So I don't need to do that. So this gives me an enemy, uh, a minion plus two. So, so fate. What would be the best course of action here? So this four, one, that's five, and then four. So I can draw a card first, which could change my turn. Let's draw a card. Okay, that that doesn't change my my my. My turn it all. So definitely silence this and hit it. That's definitely plan one. And then I'm going to give a mini plus two. That'll make it this at three one. They can hit it, hit it, and hit here. Okay. Now do I like that? Not particularly since I since I don't. But I'm gonna have to do that. So poop. Poop. Then abusive this and kill it. Okay, so now he can't kill this. Was there any way I could have done that better? Let's see. So, eh, not particularly. I could have Aldor Peacekeeper that and then traded, but, but they still both die, so eh, not the best play. Now I can recombobulate this. Summoning portal opened. Summoning portal opened. Or, mm hmm, okay. Uh, I would want to recombinate this if it if it didn't kill this. Ugh, that sucks. Okay, so kill it. I have to kill it. It's annoying. Or I could put poop and poop. But no. Do that. Do that. Do that. And then Onyxia. Let's see how you deal with Onyxia. Hopefully not MC deck. <laughs> that would be awful. Uh, let's see. Then I could recombobulate um, Onyxia. Oh, great. Wait, no, I don't have lethal. Yes, report for duty all you want. Okay, so hit. Wait, I don't have lethal, right? No, I don't. Hit. Hit. You shall pay for your insolence. Recombobulate. Oh my god, I am Melganis. Oh, Jesus. I am Melganis. Oh, that is so good. Rico Bobulator, I love you so much. That is so good. He is so fucked. Yes, well played. Oh, so good. That was fantastic. Oh my god. That was great. No, I'm 7 and 1. So I got my gold back. Oh, that was so good. Recombobulate into freaking Balganis. <laughs> Doesn't get much better than that, I guess. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> Just can't get over that. I am Malganis.
I think if he had he had to save, uh, no, he he could have saved his equality consecrate. He could have just consecrated and then traded efficiently. Maybe he could have won that one that had a chance of winning. But I don't know. It was a pretty big board, and he could have then he had to like consecrate. Oh, this is shit. This is the worst hand I've ever gotten so far. This is not good. Okay, thank God I got Stone Splitter Troll. I really don't want to put Rigon Bob in turn two. I've been getting so much value from this thing, it's insane. Okay, so it's gonna coin out a two drop. Direwolf, not the best thing to coin out. So, yeah, it doesn't change my turn. Not the best thing to coin out since it trades really inefficiently. I mean, okay, he's gonna rock bite her probably. But you are gonna take three damage to the face. Do you want to do that? You can rock bite this. You don't need to. Yeah, I can rock bite this and hit. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, flame tongue. Okay. Unfortunately, I have no way to kill that. Unless I alter a peacekeeper, it would be so weird. Oh, fairy spirits. Well, this sucks a lot. This really does suck. So bring the pain. I can cray and yeti. Oh, this sucks quite the big dick. This sucks the big. Oh no. So then I can hit the yeti into one into his first spirit that has three HP and seal of light. This, which is okay. Oh god, he has a storm for Jax, so it's gonna kill that. Which is not good, not good at all. Oh god. Oh, cockhammer. Okay. So, do I wanna Eldor Peacekeeper cockhammer? Ah, uh, not that great. I could recombobulate. I could Eldor Peacekeeper recombobulate that. Oh, that's so weird. Oh my god. What do I do? These are all kind of shitty options. Probably the option is reinforce. Recombobulate, reinforce. Ugh, oh, I, I have to. I'm gonna have to put down recombobulate. It's so bad. I'm gonna have to do it though. I, I can't just not play anything. Uh, like what would have been done in that situation? Like, I don't know. I couldn't. I couldn't do this. Plus, oh god, fourth lightning. That's awful. Uh, this is the, you know what you know what this is. This is what losing looks like. Now do I hogger? I think I hogger. I have to hogger. Let's get. Oh, oh my God! I got a voodoo doctor. It's amazing. Oh wait, one plus two plus three. I could theoretically voodoo doctor plus cog hammer plus seal of light, which could make me kill that. And, but the Voodoo Doctor, and then the Voodoo Doctor would have a, a taunt and the fine shield, which he can't get through with, with the monies he has. He does, he can actually get through it with the healing totem. So, okay, do I want to do that? Is there a benefit of doing that? Do I do Null, which he just instantly kills with this, and then he kills it, which does at least trade the board, but stupid flame tongue. Holy shit. Okay, you know what, I'm just gonna do this. This could be the worst play ever. But you know what, you know, screw it. I, I, I'm a bad at this game. And I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> this is so weird! At least if he hits it, this kills it. Oh god, this is so strange. This is so. It, it, it sucks that the flame tongue gives plus two because it instantly kills my nulls. Also, the, if I change an enemy and it's attack to one, does that make it a plus one? A one three? Mm. Well, if you rock bite her, I mean, that's not the best idea since I can kill it later. Oh, this is so weird. Oh, God. Oh, well, you know what? I I can do a ballsy play since I have seven wi got wins and I ha got all my gold back. Black? Back. So, you know what? Screw it. Just have some fun, I guess. And he seems stumped. So maybe this was the best play in, in disguise. That sucks ass. I'm not going to lie, that is the, the definition of ass suckage. Oh god. Okay, so now I have to. Wait, wait, no. I'm going to Aldor Peacekeeper and be a greedy little shit. I am not a morning person. 
At least now I can kill that stupid flame tongue. Jesus, it's such a bitch. I definitely played it on an empty board, but I just couldn't kill this stupid thing. If it gets taunt, I swear to Christ, I will punch a bitch. I will punch a bitch so hard, I, the bitch will feel it. Oh god, no. What is he? He has fire mental turn as well. So this could have been a shitty play, actually, if he has fire mental. And if he gets taunt, that is probably the worst. If he has fire mental or taunt. He probably has fire mental. I mean, it is a shaman, and fire mental is a common. He probably has rock biter though. He's, he has a spell. What is that spell? Is it sun fury? Is it rock biter? What is it? What I would do rock biter here. I mean, you, everything you ha I have fades in. Oh, wind speaker. So he's gonna kill everything. He's gonna go face. Okay, that's fine. Don't get a taunt. Thank the Lord Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, no, I don't have to. Okay, cool. So, minion plus two. Sup. Okay, then do this. Then hit it. Or I can kill that bitch. Oh, yeah, that, that, that's what I like. Cool, cool, okay. Okay, that's really good. That's really strong. That's really strong. So, the abusive sergeant was had great value there because I could k instant killy kill that stupid flame tongue. I then killed the the fire guard with my imp left and then hit it. That was good. That was good. Now next time I'm gonna have to kill this thing and this thing. So yeah, the poop poop and poop probably. Yep. Or poop poop since this regenerates and this doesn't. So. How do you deal with this? Flame, fil fire elemental is still great here. Hmm. He has a lot of cards in his hand. I wonder what he's holding onto. Hmm. I am burned out. So I just have another peacekeeper, which does deal with big things. Come on, you've roped both both turns now. You have to do something. I know you have a spell in there. Oh wow, now you're drawing a card. Jesus, that's that that's really not good. Okay, flooding the board. And then hero powering. Taunt, that's the worst. Okay, so avenge. Okay. How do I wanna do that? I probably want to clear the entire board. Can I do that? I don't I don't think so. So I can hit it with my face, and then hit that, then hit that, and then hit that. Then he can't kill this. Alternatively, I hit this, hit that with my face, but th then I take damage. Hmm, okay, okay. Or I could alter Peacekeeper this, and that doesn't trade into that, but uh, that's kind of a waste. So I think I'll hit this with my face, that's definitely gonna happen. Okay, I'll kill that. I'll kill that. Right. Okay. I'll kill that. I'll kill that. Avenge, hero power. And then that gives me another thing. Okay, cool. <clears throat> okay, I think this that was fine. It, he can't kill this unless a fire mental. A fork lightning. Don't kill this! Oh my god, hugger! Oh, thank god. And gets the gets avenged. Oh, that was so good. Orange Jesus, thank you. But you have bloodlust, so that kind of sucks. But at least just the bloodlust wasted. Uh, you know, you know what I'm. You know, at least that's just bloodlust wasted. Cause now he can't finish me off with it. Oh great! Oh, you know what? I can just silence the, his totem. I don't have any. I don't have any AOE. That could actually be a good idea. Could that? Cause that now he can't summon a totem. Uh, uh, he, uh summon a uh, freaking. What the hell is this called? A freaking taunt totem there. And now he can't summon it, which I think is fine. I don't have any AOE to kill it with, so I think that's a fine idea. And I have a body on the board. Oh yeah, he can rock biter. Ugh. 
And I knew he had that too. It just took so long to play it. Cool, now I can Elder Peacekeeper that thing. Jeez, that's not good. I need to draw some cards. Okay, that's not drawing cards. Okay, so do that. Elder Peacekeeper. No point in attacking anything since that will heal it, so. So now probably I have to kill his totems, which suck. S I probably have misplayed quite a bit this game. You guys will point it out, hopefully, if you're enjoying this. And we'll see how it goes. But I do think I'm in ahead. He does have card advantage, which sucks. Oh god! Oh wow! You got the best possible, like... Oh wow, you ass. You got the best possible outcome from that stupid thing. Oh great, yeah. Woo. So, poop. Actually, this thing is probably the most annoying, so I'm gonna kill it. And then punch him in the face. He has 8 damage on the board, he has a spell power totem, which sucks. He doesn't look like he has any spells, he has crackle, he might kill me. Okay, so it's not gonna crackle. Oh, lightning storm. Oh god. Well... That's the worst. Well, how oh well. Well, well played. Well, that sucked. I should have killed the stupid storm. I told him. Hmm. Oh well, that was awful. His deck was just really crazy. That stupid Felgar, though. I mean, Felgar the Storer getting the max didn't matter much since he does. Did he was he? He had a good idea of holding on to the lightning storm. I didn't draw any cards, so also I didn't get any card draw, which sucks also. Hmm. Yeah, just ma massive, ma massive amount of suckage is what I'm trying to start to say. So now we're seven and two. This could be our final game. Well, any games after this would be the final game. So let's see. Jesus, it's so hot in my room right about now. I will fight with honor. I switched on the AC, hopefully it doesn't, it's not too annoying, but I just have to, it's just so hot in here. I'm gonna switch it on for a while, for a little bit. So yeah, I have nothing to play, neither does he apparently, so I'm just gonna shield it now. Next turn I'll Imposter, then the turn after that I'll have Yeti. Cool, cool. And wow, he doesn't have a 2-drop either. And he's gonna hit this. Okay. Imp Master it is. I could draw cards. But you know, why not? Why not just develop the board? And it's not swipe turn just yet. Unless, no wait, he, he does have the coin, so he could coin swipe. But it only deals with this, with the Imp Master and the Imp, so not this, so we'll see. I mean, he has to play something. He can't shapeshift again, I mean. Come on, okay. Oh, that's actually really good. It sucks, actually. I could ignore that. Wait. And coin it a 1-drop? Oh, claw. Okay. That actually kind of sucks. Why did you take so long to decide that? So, now I'm gonna chill with Yeti. Probably, yep. I don't wanna silence his minion. And then go face. Pretty easy turn. The worst case scenario is he attacks this, best case he attack my face. Because now he can attack this, hit hit with his face. Which does clear the board. Unless he has, he has a swipe. Does he have swipe? He might have swipe. Oh, he doesn't. Oh, whoa. So I can silence, actually I can silence that. Which I will be doing. There's no point in waiting to draw cards since I'm definitely gonna do do this. Hit that, blue face. Yeah, screw it, I just called Master. Swipe again it would be awful, but he, he doesn't seem to have it, so hopefully he wasn't baiting. No, he doesn't have it, cool. So he's gonna hit that with his face. 
And then I don't know, it's Robocop. So uh, now I can hug her. Die, mage. Then hug her. Hmm, this is a pretty easy game, nonchalant. Not that not much thought is happening, just, you know, playing the turn, playing on curve. Now I don't have a curve, so I'm gonna have to think about what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna have to bless you of wisdom something to draw a card. Yeah, I pr probably Voodoo Doctor, the spell, spell thing, spell breaker, then Voodoo, then, then draw a card. Hmm. Or, I can do that, okay. So, I can kill this outright, which I think I will, I hate this card. Yeah, I think I'll kill it outright. Yep, I can. And then I'll play this. And then I'll voodoo doctor. Cool. Keep control of the board. Progress it. And he can't really get through this. I mean, this was pretty easy. How did he get to seven wins? Some steel. Steel wine. Spot on impression, am I right? So, uh, I don't want Aldor Peacekeeper to be honest. Uh, so let's Farewell. hit that. And then blessing of wisdom. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna hit that. And then a blessing of wisdom, the hogger as well. Hmm. Okay. Hit it. Hit it. And then we can bob. Eh. Not the best to come bob. It's fine because since I had a 6 2, now I have 5 5. It's fine. Not the greatest. But you know, not all the combos are the best. I had really great to come so far, so yeah. Yep, we won. So that's a well played. We are now 8 and 2. So yeah, will, will the next game be the deciding the deciding thing? The deciding game? Will it not be? Find out in the next part, you guys. We just hit the 30 minutes. And yeah, hopefully you guys are still enjoying this series. I will see you in the next part. Don't forget to give me tips, give me commentary, what all my misplays, especially again on my losses. So yes, I will see you then, you guys. Bye.